campers. We're working our way out to I-80 from the truck stop we parked at last night. The pilot here in Manuka. Two miles ahead, turn left on North Ridge Road. Much like the Loves in Sioux Falls, this one has kind of a back exit that kicks you out to a stoplight instead of having to turn left onto a major road from just a stop sign. Okay. We want to left turn, but we want to left turn from the right left turn lane. That's how this works. Yeah, no, they, this one has much better and much more helpful signs to uh, direct you to the proper exit than the one in Sioux Falls did. Yeah. So yeah, uh, Arby's was indeed closed. So they're, they're remodeling, so no buffalo chicken tenders for us. That's fine, that's fine. We just had breakfast the other day. Uh, and we had breakfast in Rapid. Okay.
like a 30 spur. Probably the original Lincoln Highway routing through Fort Wayne, Indiana. Keep our speed down, because I know this is a stoplight that likes to change a lot. Ding, ding. And we're good. All right. I think we are safely out of Fort Wayne. I think the rest of this road is just like good running to Ohio. I hope. <laughs> I guess we'll find out, right? I have high hopes for Ohio. Ohio is very good at making highways. Especially highways that are not interstate but still allow for high speed travel. They are highly skilled at such things. Y'all, I was right about Ohio. Oh my goodness, this road is so nice here. <laughs> Look at this. This is like an interstate. This is practically an interstate. It's just got some left and right turns off of it, but it's practically an interstate. Look at this. Ohio, y'all know how to do stuff. Y'all know how to make good roads. I've said that before and I will say it again. Ohio, good job. Good job. You'll make really good roads, really good service plazas on your on your toll road. It's just better. It's just better. Ohio is just Indiana, but better. I've, I've determined this. Ohio is better Indiana. Going three that miles ahead, take the ramp and then monitor. march left on US 23 South. Exit 30 East to the right. really an exit, but my GPS thinks it is. Point five miles ahead, merge left on US 23 South. Alright. We can do that. Got a little close to the rumble strip there, but it's fine. It's fine. Alright, do we need any loves? Uh, there's a car next to me who hasn't realized his lane no longer exists. Good job, good job. <laughs> Idiot. 5.8 miles ahead, turn right on ramp to US 30 East. Ooh. Do we need a loves right now? I don't think I need a loves right now. I've got three and a half hours left on my clock. I have not decided where we're stopping yet. I think we might be running into my 70 hour clock and that has me a little bit worried, but it's fine. It's fine. We'll stop at a, a next rest area, probably. Yeah, there's rest areas on this road in this state. It's wonderful. <laughs> like next rest area, maybe we'll stop and uh, start looking for our stopping location. I'm not married to the idea of a truck stop tonight. We can go without. I just need somewhere I can plant my trailer. Have an app. This rest area has vending machines. I'll be honest, this US highway, this state highway that we are on right now, US Highway 30, built and maintained by the state of Ohio, is nicer than interstates in so many other places. Uh, way to trucks go, I assume. Uh, trucks right. Okay, cool. Okay, that sign needs to be a little bigger. Miles ahead. Turn left on ramp to US 30 East. <laughs> but overall, I think I appreciate that they trust ahead. us to Turn figure it out. On ramp to US 30 East. They kind of trust us to figure it out, and uh, you know, that's that's encouraging. That's encouraging. Do, 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 do. Oh, wow, there's a ton of parking here. Cool. Let's get a spot that's nice and close to the bathroom. Look at that. You don't even need to use the spots to either side to get into yours. And we are straight in the spot. We are occupying the entire spot. We have plenty of room to get out. Other people can get in next to us. 
Look at this. This is beautiful. This is so good. <laughs> I like this highway. I wish the Indiana leg of US 30 was this nice. That'd actually make this a really good bypass for the uh, for the toll road. <laughs> This has so far exceeded my expectations. It's wild. Like, the, the bit in Indiana was like, wow, this is terrible. And then you get to Ohio, it's like, oh, all right. <laughs> all righty, we've reached the point where it's time for us to exit the uh, US 30 highway and return to the interstate system. There has not been a single stoplight in the state of Ohio so far for this road. That's pretty freaking good <laughs> compared to uh, compared to what we saw on this road in um, in Indiana. All right. So, Going three miles ahead, take ramp to I seventy one north. like half a mile back. 
cargo is limited access and it's a uh, whoop into a freeway into Interstate 76. Alright, let's see if we can't get a spot here that's not exposed to the freeway track. Really? Really? Am I gonna get really? Did I cheat or something? Am I cheating? How did I do this? What did I do to deserve this good luck? What have I done? <laughs> How? How is this? I should not be able to get this good of a spot at this time of night. I should probably just pull up now. Let's leave him some space just in case there's someone in front of him and he needs to back up to get out. So, dude. Dude. And there's actually still room behind me for another truck, I think. I think. So we're like perfectly between these two sidewalks and there's another full gap at the same length. Cool. So, I'm just going to inch forward just a little bit more. I feel like a little bit more would be fine. There we go. Yeah, because I think that's really going to be plenty of space for somebody else to get in behind me. All right, so change sleeper berth. We have one hour, four minutes left on our clock. That will roll over to tomorrow. Sorry, one hour, five minutes. It gave me one minute back. It's like, oh, you've already been here a minute, so I'll just give you that. Uh, summary, we have one hour, five minutes on our 70 hour clock, and we get eight hours and 13 minutes back tonight. So that'll be nine hours and three minutes to drive to, oh, sorry. Yeah, no, nine hours and three minutes to drive tomorrow because I got a 15 minute pre-trip. Might have to fuel tomorrow too, so that might actually be less than less than nine hours of drive time tomorrow. If we do have to stop and fuel. My algorithm's like, oh you don't need to fuel after you uh after you stop in Illinois all the way to Newark. <laughs> I'm like, that sounds sketchy, and I'm at half a tank now, and we've still got four hundred and nine miles. I'm like, alright, we're probably fueling tomorrow then. I don't like to get that low on fuel. Yeah. We are parked. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. My name's Elio Dare, Azure Angel17 on Twitch, Xbox Live, and Steam. Drop in, say hi, and let me know if you enjoy the videos by clicking like or subscribe. And of course, come say hi on the Twitters at Elio Dare, no apostrophe in the username. Thank you guys so much for joining and watching and doing the things. Have a great day.